Now, I'm Regina On. We're learning new details today about the events surrounding Jamie Kloss's abduction. Court documents say 21-year-old Jake Patterson admitted to killing Jamie's parents. NBC 26's Ryan Curry is live in Barron now, where Patterson made his first appearance in court. Ryan. Yeah, good evening, Regina. Jake Patterson has now been formally charged with two counts of first-degree homicide and one count of kidnapping. And court documents released today say that he told authorities when he was being arrested that he did it in regards to kidnapping Jamie and killing his, her parents, James and Denise Kloss. Now, court documents also stated that Patterson saw Jamie at a bus stop one day and knew that she was the one he wanted to take. Records say he took several measures such as changing the license plates of his car and shaving his head to avoid leaving evidence at the crime scene. And records also say he would trap Jamie underneath his bed and put totes and free weights around them so she could not escape. The records did say that she once freed herself last Thursday while Patterson wasn't home. She then later alerted a neighbor who called 911. And here's what the district attorney had to say following Patterson's charges. The prosecution team that you see assembled here today wants justice for James and Denise Kloss and for Jamie Kloss. I assure you that while you will not receive public statements from my office about this case, the prosecutors who I have introduced and myself will be working hard to convict the defendant of the charges filed against him. You are charging... Now, court documents also stated Patterson thought he got away with the crimes of kidnapping and murder after he wasn't found two weeks after the abduction. His next court date is set for February 6th at 11 a.m. His cash bond has been set for $5 million. The district attorney did, however, say he expects this to go to a full trial. Reporting live in Barron, Ryan Curry, NBC 26.